Hey loves, it's your girl April. So today's video is one that I am so excited about doing because for one, it is featuring one of my favorite YouTubers, which is Candy Johnson. I have been watching her for like ever on YouTube. Um, she is just like one of the best makeup artists here on YouTube as there are many others. She is one of my favorite. So if you are looking to transform yourself into someone like say, Angelina Jolie, Johnny Depp, The Little Mermaid, um, Maleficent, oh my god, just an array of different characters, or you just want a very pretty, simple makeup look or something dramatic, then you have to check her out. She is, like, amazing. So, one thing I did notice, because I love Too Faced products, you girls know I'm always raving about Too Faced, Too Faced, Too Faced. So, recently, about a month and a half ago, two months ago, I did come across Too Faced YouTube channel and just so happily Candy Johnson was on there for their new uh, waterproof better than sex mascara and she was actually a mermaid which I loved the video the commercial whatever you want to call it it was just like so amazing and I did leave a comment on Too Faces video about it and when she replied I was just like in heaven so yes we youtubers do have our favorites and we do have those that we just love dearly and candy johnson is one of my favorites so with that being said this month i did get a box from beautycon which is a seasonal subscription you can either purchase it annually which is 99 dollars or seasonally for 29 dollars now i do have a five dollar off coupon code that i will post for you girls below in the video description box as well as that as I wanted to show you the goodies in this actual box so like I said it is seasonal so it's not going to come out every month but when it does come out which is seasonal you have loads of items in the box that are just like really really worth the wait so the box did come just like this really really well wrapped and concealed and oh my gosh now the first thing that I noticed in the box which I'm definitely going to keep is my fave candy johnson right here and all of the products that she likes to use is on the back so you do get loads of products in this box because for one it's seasonal unlike most boxes that are monthly you do get probably like five products in this box for beautycon this is the summer essentials box and you actually get 13 actual items and this is one of them which is a portrait of candy and I just love her she's just absolutely gorgeous make sure you check out her YouTube channel and I'll post it below so all of the items were wrapped like this and of course I already went ahead and opened it because I couldn't wait to show you guys um, I wanted to just look prior to that so their tissue paper comes with plastic around it which is really really a cool idea so it's very very professional looking and the box is filled with stuff like filled 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 so in no particular order, I'm just going to go by of what um, is in the box. Now the first thing that I noticed was my favorite and I love Too Faced. I do have their Better Than Sex Mascara, but this is the waterproof one, okay? Waterproof. Better Than Sex Mascara is actually better than sex, okay? And I'm just going to be honest and say that. This mascara is amazing. I don't use it on my top lashes because I use the Size Queen Mascara by Too Faced. But for my bottoms, I have used many different mascaras. And this one is by far the best one, especially for my bottoms. Then I'll use this one. With the uh, Size Queen, it's a bigger brush. And I love big mascara brushes. But this one right here really, really gets into your lashes. You'll have like really, really full bottom lashes with this one right here. So I was so excited when I got this because this will go right to my collection of Too Faced products. The next one is a Cover FX brush. And this one here is the Contour Brush 5F3. Now, I've never seen a contour brush shape this particular way, but for one, it is really concealed in this great plastic, so you can just unzip that, and the brush does come just like so. Now, I did not even notice, but this brush is actually a double-sided, a duo brush, which is absolutely amazing. So, this end is great for concealer. If you want to do like your highlight under your eyelids, you can do that with this end right here, the tail end. And then you go ahead and do your contouring. Like I said, no particular order. I do have the Smashbox. So like I said, you get some really great stuff in the Beautycon box, which is seasonal because these are kind of like high-end brand cosmetics. 
Um, these are not like brands that you've never heard of prior, but really, really great brands. So Smashbox is another great brand. I do own a few of these, and this is the Brow Tape Shaping Powder. And the color that I have is in the color Taupe. And you can hear like there's like kind of like a shaking motion inside of it, like a bead that's inside of it. And this is just going to basically sculpt your brows. This is a powder formula, and it is dry. And it is in a color taupe, so for those days when I want to go lighter, I can use this because I do use like a concealer, or not a concealer, excuse me, a brow pomade that's kind of like light like this. And what I would do to fill it in is I would go over with the actual brush and fill it in with the powder. Now the bristle or the brush is actually like a fine um, pen at the end, which is probably going to make it a lot easier to apply. I'm not really sure if you could see on camera, but I did have like a little gap, a few gaps in my brows that needed to be filled in. And this does actually work. So ladies, yes, if you have never heard of BeautyCon or you want a really great box subscription, I would highly suggest taking um, a look at that. I will post the information and the coupon code below. The next one is more or less like a luxury sample, and this is the Vera Spa Beyond Tan Face Moisturizer. So I did get to use that this morning, and as you guys know, my skin is kind of oily, so I don't like to use a lot of moisturizers. This is also a gradual tanner, so I did use just a tiny bit before my foundation, which it just gradually tans. So unfortunately, I can't really tell right now because I do have on makeup. But what I'm going to end up doing is once I cleanse my face tonight, I will use a little bit more so that way when I wake up in the morning, I'll be able to tell. And if this works and it just gradually tans me, then I will purchase this. But it's a luxury size sample. It's a facial moisturizer. You don't need a lot on your face because it's just a moisturizer and it just gradually tans. Now also is the Garnier Skin Active Clearly Brighter, and this is just a daily moisturizer as well. This is, of course, a full-size product, and so yeah, I did get to use this also. I used this actually yesterday, and it is sunscreen as well, and now the good thing about this one when I used it yesterday is it really my makeup lasted a little bit longer. Sometimes I'll use like the Nivea Men's Pro Shaving Balm. On my face, sometimes I'll use the Too Faced, Primed and Poreless. I use like different stuff to see how it's going to react to my skin. And this one actually worked well. I was outside during the day and all I did was just spritz a little bit on my hand, on the back portion of my hand. And it's just like this creamy solution or color. And like I said, you don't, you don't need a lot of this because it is a facial moisturizer. But it also has sunblock in it. And because it's so hot outside and it is very sunny in Arizona... You do need to make sure that you're wearing a sunblock at all times. I even put this on my 14-year-old daughter because, for one, she needs sunblock. And this just also moisturizes your face. It does get really dry out here, so this did come in handy. And I liked it because, for one, it's a full-size product. It has SPF 15 in it. And it just brightens and smooths the skin out. So it did make the application of my foundation a lot easier when I did apply this. But I did not use this today. I used it yesterday. So I was trying to test out everything and let you guys know prior to me doing the video. So this one right here is the Benzac Acne Solutions. Now it is a blemish clearing solution or hydrator. But it is also for those who have oily skin, okay? Now, this will help with any type of oily skin as well as it will also help if you have any type of acne. And what it does is it soothes and balances the skin while preventing block pores. It also hydrates the skin without building up any excess oils. And I'm always complaining about, oh, my skin is so oily, it's so oily. And I clean my face, like, all the time. Prior to makeup, after removal of makeup, I do this religiously. I use a acne astringent just to absorb a lot of the oils in my face prior to putting on makeup. But no matter what I do, it seems like my foundation does not last throughout the day because my skin is so oily. And I'm not really sure if it's what I eat, my diet, or what have you, or is it just certain makeup products but some things work for me and some things don't so i did try this out and i did um get somewhat of a good result i've been trying out this box for a couple of days only because i just want to see how each item works but 
so far so good it does get really hot out here and of course we do perspire and that may cause a lot of the reasons why my skin or my makeup doesn't last however even in the fall and winter months it still does not last like normal um, skin or just regular skin would last I see a lot of women whose their makeup is on for the entire day and it still looks flawless with mine it seems like the actual foundation sometimes is like sip, slipping off of my face or my pores have sucked it up so this was so far so good but a lot of products with me they'll work for the first couple of days and then they don't so I'm just gonna constantly test that and use it daily and see how it works for me and if it does then I will be more than happy to purchase this but this is the hydrate 3 and yes Benzac acne solutions if you have like acne scarring this will really help with blemishing it soothes the skin so one of my favorites, which I have used this prior, or I've used their eye makeup remover. This is the Neutrogena Ultra Light Cleansing Oil. So this just removes your makeup, waterproof makeup, dirt, and oil from your face. Now, I would not use this during the daytime because it does have oil in it. And, of course, I'm trying to actually keep the oil at bay when I'm pri um, applying my makeup. But at night, the products that I use, they do dry my face out. And you ever just have like you cleanse your face so much that it feels tight that's how my face feels at the end of the night so sometimes I'll use Cetaphil and sometimes I'll use like um, Olay, Olay and Olay was working for a minute but then it still was kind of like drying my skin out so I used this last night and it actually worked well so my face wasn't so oily like if you're thinking of like oil like baby oil then it's not like that it's more or less like a lightweight oil it will remove the makeup but it also keeps your face moisturized and this you could pick up anywhere like Target, Walmart, Walgreens Neutrogena is a really good brand and I used to always use like their self tanning lotion you girls know I like to do the tanning thing so mm. also in this box is one of the NYX gels and this is in the color cashmere very pretty light gold I'm not really even sure if I have this one in my collection but do you see that gold color so pretty it's like a champagne gold and these are really great to use as eyeshadow bases so I'm thinking that this is one of Candy's favorites but what? NYX does have some really great um, pencils especially if you want to use them as eyeshadow bases you can use them just for about anything any type of makeup look that you're going for but this one here is in cashmere so I didn't get to use this one yet but this is the NYX ombre lip and the color that I have here is whew, very shocking it's peaches and cream which is more or less an orange and kind of like red ombre lips okay so first of all I don't wear a lot of reds but this one right here it's more or less it's not really like a red it to me it seems on the kind of like the it kind of reminds me of Lady Danger by MAC which is kind of like a coral red and then you have this end which is like a really light orange like a peachy color this is more or less like the oranges and cream popsicle color and they're gorgeous together really really pretty together so the ombre lip and this must be a new item because I have never seen this at Ulta and as much as I love going to the makeup store I have never seen this one. so this here I will be using it in my human hair loose wave here I'm always raving about oh how much I love loose wavy hair I love it I love it I love it and I do have one some today but this one is not human this is actually a synthetic half wig yes. this is by Redkin this is the fashion waves 07 and this is just to hydrate those waves if you want beachy waves this is made with sea salt this is called a sea salt spray and if you want more waves you want your waves to be popping you want them to be hydrated then this here is a huge size bottle of redkin and i will be giving this a try i just finished doing a video on some loose waves and I wish I would have thought of using this I did see it in the box but forgot all about it as well as there are instant cooling body soothers like little samples like this facial cleansers which is always cool to take with you a 15% off and free shipping um, coupon code for the 17 magazine for those of you who have teenagers so yes girls the coupon code is for five dollars off and it will expire the very last day of august this is the summer essentials box so make sure you check it out 
but also make sure you check out Candy Johnson's channel on YouTube. She is like wonderful. I really, really like her makeup looks. Just her videos in general are so professional and just very well put together. And on that note, I hope you enjoyed this video. I will post the links for you girls below. Stay diva and divalicious. Make sure you rate, comment, subscribe, sum this video up, and I'll see you girls and guys on my next video.